G'day and welcome to this edition of Radio Waves. I'm Glenn, VK2 HTV. And we're looking at the results of our antenna build of the DX Commander expedition. We're going to look at some SWR results and also just some tightening up of the elements and how I uh, made a little 3D print. <laughs> So we've got the DX Commander up now for about a week and one of the things at the moment is that it's very windy so what I want to do is straighten up those elements so they go up one side and down the other and that way we have a nice SWR and the signal getting out. You can see there that it's uh, quite windy at the moment and it's bending quite significantly. How do we achieve that and make those elements a little bit more taut? Well, I got the 3D printer out and printed off this little three-hole device, I guess you call it. And what I did is put it down the pole and then it gave a nice clean separation of those elements up and back down. It uh, actually was a little bit too big on the centre pole, so I just used a bit of amalgamating tape to actually bring it back up to where that 40 and 15 meter element comes to so that is the little solution that I've just made and we still put the uh, aquarium tube on to actually separate those elements and that uh, that way it makes it nice and tight and gives me a good SWR even in some pretty strong winds that we're experiencing at the moment so you can see those elements are nice and taut and gives me a great SWR even in some pretty strong winds that we're experiencing at the moment. Let's have a look now at the SWR coming off the IC7300 and this is on 15 metres and you can see with the tuner out we've got about 1.3 there right in the middle of the FT8 band pretty good and with the tuner in it goes down to, to nothing, can't even see it then on 10 metres with no tuner in you can see again absolutely clean and 20 metres no tuner you can see that it's pretty much one to one and it only gets up to about 1.5 there on 40 metres again excellent SWR there and that's with no tuner in line as well so that's a pretty good result and a really good antenna Thanks for watching and I hope you can tune in again for another edition of Radio Waves. <laughs>